We all understand acceleration. It's the rate of change of velocity. This 4,891 pound Tesla Model S P100D does it best, reaching 30, 40, 50, and 60 miles per hour from a standstill more quickly than any other production vehicle we've ever tested, full stop. In our testing, no production car has ever cracked 2.3 seconds from 0 to 60 miles per hour, but Tesla has, in 2.275507139 seconds, launching a Model S P100D, weighing 5062 with gear and driver. In full-on ludicrous Easter egg mode snaps your body in a manner that is utterly impossible to replicate in any other street-legal production car on normal tires and dry asphalt at a mid-dollar 100,000 price point. We regard 0 to 30 mile per hour acceleration times as the benchmark for how hard a car launches and this new Tesla gets their 0.05 second ahead of the next quickest, aforementioned, 0.92 second 911 Turbo S the two run pretty even through 40 miles per hour, after which the Tesla pulls ahead, maintaining a 0.2 second lead from 60 miles per hour through 90 miles per hour. The two cross the quarter mile mark together at 10.5 seconds at which point the Tesla is running 125.0 miles per hour, and the Porsche is traveling 6.8 miles per hour faster. But let's back up and re-examine the launch. As you know, we start our acceleration clock the way the NHRA does, when the front tires cross the one-foot mark. For the record, the Tesla hit that mark in 0.26 seconds, at which point it was already traveling at 12.7 miles per hour for an average jerk rating of 128.8 feet slash sec 3. The Porsche did it in 0.20 second but was only going 11.7 miles per hour, yet it managed a jerk rating of 191.8 feet slash sec 3. The Ferrari LaFerrari bested them both at 0.19 second and 13.1 miles per hour, jerking worth 180.6 feet slash sec 3, a remarkable hole shot for a rear drive car.